And if you were planning on going hiking this morning, of course, uh, I don't know, it's a little wet outside. Desiree, good morning to you. Um, what mountain are you at and uh, how can you help us get to the mountain? A little wet this morning, a little chilly, but it's not stopping anybody from coming out here to a mountain in Tempe. And if you take a look behind me, uh, you can see that there's yellow tape here preventing folks from entering the mountain. But we've seen hiker after hiker uh, either walk under the tape, walk around it. But what's really important to know why the tape is up, that's because city officials are telling us there have been reports of aggressive bees and stings within the last few days. So this morning, the city will be out here assessing the situation, most likely trying to locate maybe where those beehives are on the mountain to see just how serious this issue is. So each year, Arizona Poison Control Center typically receives about 2,500 calls a year for scorpion stings and even 150 to 200 for snake bites. But again, this morning, they're warning us that bees um, are putting us in a dangerous situation potentially here at a mountain. They're called killer bees, but in reality, their stings are actually a little less potent and painful than some other common bee stings. But the dangerous thing here is that they defend their nesting sites very aggressively, sometimes stinging their victims multiple times. Uh, so if we come back out here live, you'll actually uh, see people um, entering the mountain, but we spoke to a runner this morning. Uh, listen to what she has to say. Um, it doesn't really frighten me. I don't really see them up in the morning, so I haven't run into them, but I've seen the signs. Yes, yeah, so she didn't see any this morning, but that doesn't mean they're not here. So again, here live, uh, we just saw people kind of walking right under the tape. Uh, we warned them, but you know, I guess it's kind of enter at your own risk. So officials say that if you are stung or get attacked on the mountain, you want to run away as quickly as possible, get to shelter. And then if you are stung, be aware of an allergic reaction, itching, maybe a rash over your entire body, difficulty breathing. And in that case, that is when you should call uh, for emergency medical services. Uh, so for now, we'll send it back to you guys and hopefully people will uh, listen to the warning uh, yeah. from officials this morning. The, the, the fortunate thing is a mountains a pretty mellow trail. So even if you you know run into a hive and let's hope they don't, you know, you can get out of there. Like you said, run. That's what you're supposed to do. But these bees will always yeah. warn you, uh, Des. I've been reporting on them forever. They will. If, if, if you're ever somewhere and all of a sudden bees start, start like flying into your head, get away from where you oh, are because yeah. that's your last <laughs> warning. Because the next thing is, is going to be yeah. a bunch of them jumping on you. Exactly. So just get out of Dodge. All right, Des. <laughs> thank you.